This is episode five of the Burning Rubber podcast. Look, I haven't done one in a while, but I'm doing one now. I'm going to start being consistent on the channel. I know I've said this so many times in the past, but I am going to start being consistent. I know what I'm doing for this year, so I'm going to produce more and more content for you guys to keep yourself entertained and just generally just watch them. So, we've got two subjects to talk about today. Um, we've got Ben Shadowman business about him being sacked and Ricardo business about potentially being a second driver for Red Bull. So let's get into this. First off, we're talking about the Ben Shalomar. Look, personally, I don't think he should have got the job. He shouldn't have got the job in the first place. The Gida hates women. He hates women. And even though he said, oh, yeah, it don't affect me, I didn't mean it. Yeah, you do mean it. And you even admitted it. You admitted it saying, oh, yeah, it don't affect me. So you're basically admitting it on what you said. The guy hates women and he's so corrupt. He's corrupt. And the team's... Don't respect him. The team principals don't respect him. The whole paddock don't respect him. No one respects him. And he shouldn't have got the job in the first place. And there was a sale from a Saudi company. £20 billion. Pounds. It's either pounds or euros. I was going to say pounds. £20 billion. And that is a lot. A Saudi company offering Liberty Media... That, that ownership. So, yeah, personally, I know I'm going to say this again. Shouldn't have got the job in the first place. No respect to him in the paddock. Um, yeah, nothing much else to say. He, he took over the FIA bus role, replacing Gene Tut when Gene Tut retired. Another quick one as well. He re- replaced Gene Tut for the F1 2021 season. He lasted one season. And then he lasted, he lasted one season, and then he was sacked, gone, sacked from Formula One, never to be seen again. Don't want him to see. I don't want to see him again. Gone. See you later. So, yeah, that's all I've got to say about the FI bus. Um, Ricardo, on to Ricardo and Perez business. Look, weren't a surprise. Not a surprise to me. After Perez said that quote about, oh yeah, the sapper never moves over. Red Bull was thinking to himself, if you're going to dog us like that, we're going to bring another geezer in, and that is Ricardo. He signed for Red Bull for the reserve driver spot. And now, there is news going about now that he will be a driver, second driver for Red Bull. And it's not a surprise either. Perez will be gone. Out the team. I don't know where he's going to go. I don't know where he will go. But. Highly. Chance. That Ricardo is going to take that second driver spot. They're going to be first driver Max. Second driver Ricardo. Look. Ricardo. Is not. Going to stay. At Red Bull. As reserve driver. He's not just going to be reserve driver. He's obviously going to go into that second driver spot. With him. And Max at the front line. Look, Ric- look, Ricardo, he's been in the game for ages. He had a huge potential, but I think he just flopped. He blew it away. I thought he was going to be world champion. He blew that as well. Could be world champion, but nah, don't think so. All the credit's going to go to Max, a star boy, Max. Christian Horner's going to give all the props, all the upgrades to Max. Look, Ricardo's not going to win a title again, but you know that Ricardo will be in that second driver spot. And I'm calling it right now. I'm calling it right now. So, that's the end of the video. Um, hope you enjoyed it. Um, we're five minutes in now. So, like, subscribe, turn on notifications. All links will be in the description below for my YouTube, Twitch, and Twitter. Everything in the description below. So, thanks for watching. Bye, guys.